And so we return again to Hidden Dangerous Deluxe Addons, ladies, gentlemen, and otherwise. Zig Shadow here, and this time we're playing Mountain Pass by Kevin Mitchell. It's a repurposed map from Italy, I know, but I haven't played this map in Yonks, so hey, maybe this time, maybe this repurposed map is going to be a bit of an interesting new revisit. Should hope so. Anyways, our mission here is to kill the general and escape. Simple as that. It's it's straight up as simple as that. Let's immediately begin, shall we? Yeah, okay. My loadout for today is a bit experimental, I should say. PPSH, Panzer Force, and the Johnson rifle. It's not a scope rifle, but no worries. I do have backups. The binoculars. I'm not sure if these actually zoom in more than the regular scopes. Maybe they do, maybe they don't, but they do provide a much better field of view. So, if there are snipers in the map, which I assume there will be, I think I'll be able to spot them with this. Still, though, needing, needing to use it first before you can actually zoom is kind of a bit annoying, but. Well, that's uh, that's hidden dangers for you. Some some usables are um, like pistols and such. Yeah. Anyways, do we have? Yes, yes, we do. We do have a tactical map. That's nice. Kill the general and escape to the half track. The mission. Oh, hello there. Is that a tank I see? Well, it's a good thing I got uh, I got a whole bunch of Panzer Force, huh? that and uh, TNT too just in case assuming I can actually get close to that thing without getting the t whole team blown up to smithereens wait a minute is that it's another tank <laughs> oh man uh, hey is that the half truck yeah that's probably the exit half truck oh my goodness right then there's a general somewhere around here and I imagine we'll need to assassinate him but I imagine he'll be covered by snipers soldiers tanks armor it's gonna be one of those days where my bazooka carrying my anti-tank carrying strategies will come into play instead of just being put to this hello I didn't see you guys before. What? Why are you here all of a sudden? Oh. Is that a uh, is that how we came here? With a single fighter plane. <laughs> Four guys just fit in a single tiny little fighter plane. <laughs> well, all right then. Well, at least the uh, at least the Whoever made the campaign was nice enough to add in a couple of anti-tank solutions in case the player didn't bring any. I'm I'm really glad that the mappers so far have been really, really nice in terms of equipment handling. Can be a bit tricky to use the to balance things around, but you know I'm glad that the mapper did pay attention. Unfortunately, I've my entire equipment arsenal is full, so I can't exactly grab those. But you know, in case I miss my shots, which is a very likely event, I'll probably need them. So, what's the goal here? Should I try to destroy the tanks first, or should I maybe? Yeah, I imagine if I try to assault, if I try to skip on through to the village now, I'll have to deal with that tank and. Would you look at that? That tank is watching this side, so trying to approach that might not be the best of ideas. But this tank is currently overlooking the water, so if I try to zoom on here, I'll be able to destroy the tank. Walk to here through the road, attack from behind. The tank won't see us coming, hopefully. I'll be able to destroy the tank from behind and then assault it from there. Sounds good, is it not? Slight risks, <clears throat> slight risks, however, because there's still this whole, you know, 
this whole bit here. And as we've seen before, in the if I mem if my memories haven't failed me yet, in Italy, there are enemies that do show up here. So I imagine the trip isn't going to be as easy as it, as it seems. I fully expect to die here a couple of times. I all the trees and the fog and the whatnot. Yeah, uh, unlike base assault, I'm not going to be too particularly upset if I die because. Yeah, the battlefield here isn't exactly an easy one to traverse through, so... Anyways, let's actually start up, huh? Crouch down, just in case there are enemies over the yon over the yonder. Fog's not exactly helping, but, um... Okay, let's see... Enemy, enemy... <coughs> Any enemies over the distance? I really like the ambient noise here. It's it's a rare occurrence in custom add-ons. Sometimes they're silent, other times they are. Uh, they only have wind noises. I'm guessing we're kind of dead smack in the middle of a serious. Why? Uh, any particular reason why? Oh no! Please don't tell me. Okay, that was a bit awkward, but whatever. Okay, we'll, we'll try to uh, look at what we are dealing with here. There could be enemies down there. Or up there. Check the binoculars. Okay. I'm gonna need to really check the mountain sides here because snipers. So many snipers. Always snipers. Okay. Doesn't seem like there's anything here, but... Yeah, let me turn... Oh, this is really awkward. I should've... I should've brought a sniper rifle. <laughs> should've brought a sniper rifle. Why is it that every time that I didn't bring any sniper rifles, I always just regret my decision. Oh yeah, sure, I'm gonna... I'm gonna have a little bit of a break. Let's try bringing in a regular rifle this time around. Nope, instant regret. It's been like that since Yamashita's gold rocket. Well, maybe not less so rocket because the M1 carbine did do acceptably well for a small map. But a big map like this? Eh. There's a bit of a mountain side over there. Has the tank moved in any way? The tank is still facing the other way. Okay, so we're gonna try to head that way. Is it that way? Okay, I think it's that way. I'm gonna need Overwatch. Uh, right. As always, I'm gonna have Mad move in, check if it's clear, and then have everyone else move in. Be just like old times. Just like old times. However, I do need everyone to pay attention to the other sets of the fields in case enemies do show up. I don't know if there's going to be any kind of enemy spawns, but it's always a possibility. Yeah, it's a USB PSH. Okay. Right then. That way. I'm just gonna, I'm really hoping that there's no, hang on. Nothing. Always a slight bit of scare every time the game lags a little. I keep expecting enemy spawns to happen somewhere. Okay, we're just gonna play it safe, right? We're gonna get to the tank, and then we're gonna blast it. It's facing the other way. Nothing could possibly go wrong. As long as there's no enemy spawning in, or appearing just right up around the hill, we should be good. Check the right side. Nothing. Good. Good, good, so far so good. Okay. Fairbarn's watching that side. I do need to bring Fairbarn in because he because well he's the other guy with the Panzer Force, so Alright. Pretty soon we're gonna reach this hill here and we'll be overlooking the tank, so I, I don't really know if I need to bazooka snipe again or if I can get away with 
moving closer to it because you know facing a tank head on not the brightest of ideas not at all right be careful careful this is it anything on this side I don't see any enemy troops seems to be okay right what's the tank it's right there any enemy troops right right next to it doesn't seem to be anything on the hills binoculars please all right okay not sure if there are any soldiers there I can't exactly see anything all right let's try to uh, see if I'll attract its attention by standing up here it's not moving at all Right, maybe I can try to destroy it from up close. Man, it's such a... It's such a... <coughs> Sorry. It is such an attractive target. Like, I really want to get close to it and blow it up, but... I know it's probably a setup. It's very likely a setup. Uh, one plan is to approach from here and try to destroy it somewhere halfway. But another plan is to circle it. <coughs> circle it. I'm sorry, my throat here is... <coughs> I'm still a bit ill, so a lot of my words are going to slur a little. A little. Sorry about that. Is it okay if I go here? Yeah, it is. Good. No slipping, alright? Any enemies that I can see from here? This is such a good range. I am very tempted to stamp right now and try to destroy it with the Panzer Force, but snipers gotta really pay attention. They always hide in the worst possible places. And you won't know if they're there until they try shooting at you. Sometimes sometimes it's like at the edges too, so you never know. Okay, but this tank right here, I should be able to destroy it. Here it goes. Up. Yes, that's one tank down. Excellent. Good, good. Now we should be able to cross that way without being harassed. Good, good. I should probably grab the other Panzer Force now that the... Uh, I'd have spent this one. Yeah, okay, that's a good idea. It is possible that there's going to be more than two tanks that I can see, so... Better safe than sorry, as they say. Better safe than sorry. No reports of combat from any of the other squad members, so, you know, all is good so far. First blood is in my hands. Good, good. Not in the enemies. It's not the usual, typical enemies popping up at the start of the map. Here we go. Ooh. Got an STG as well. Useful alternative, I suppose, if the PPSH ran out of ammo, but hopefully it, it won't get to that. Yeah. I wonder if the PPSH will find use after all. 71 rounds in the mag. A couple of hits will absolutely kill someone question is, will I, am I going to really need them? A whole bunch of enemies showing up, very possible. Okay. I'm gonna need Overwatch. Hard drive's playing shenanigans again, that's normal. I'll probably need to stand up. Okay. Can I actually turn, no, I have to... Yeah, okay. That, oh, man, that's awful. Uh, should I should just brought a sniper rifle. Alright. Okay, nothing there. So maybe we can try to close in. I'm not sure if I should try to 
spread my troops as much as possible. So one, two, three, four here maybe. But you, you never know where enemies could come from. And in a map that's this big, I want to be as careful as possible. Right, let's try to close into the, to that mountain. 